Well, welcome to Old Trafford. It is a ground that is absolutely rocking as we start the second half. With Manchester United already confirmed for three points, at least for now. There is a way back for PSV, but it's not looking particularly likely right now. As Manchester United are playing some beautiful football. And they lead by four goals to nil. And Martial, in 23 minutes, gets a hat-trick. And for the season, he gets four goals, equaling that of Romelu Falcao last season. All of a sudden, Liverpool's decisions regarding Falcao and buying Martial are looking completely justified in, in the biggest way. And it's been a wonderful performance, even without their captain, Wayne Rooney. And uh, they've had a, a uh, route show of PSV tonight. In front of their home crowd, Martial goes down and fouls with him. Not like a foul to me. And Jones. PSV have barely had a sniff up front. David De Gea has had nothing to do. And uh, let's not forget David De Gea is actually back in the Manchester United squad following the draw at Liverpool. but he's had very little work to do tonight. He's just have had all the ball and all the possession and all the pretty passing and just thunderous shots. And Martial, he had all his own show, to be honest. Look at his passing, it's absolutely majestic stuff. And Manchester United, Depay whips it in. And one of the good people is going to try a shot. Oh, it's in! Oh my word, Aaron Hillwood scores an absolute rocket from nowhere. Oh, beautiful goal. How far out was that? Pick this one out. Aaron Hillwood chests it down, looks up, bang. Oh, it's definitely over the line. No need for goal line technology. What an absolute belter. Aaron Hilbert gets there. His first Champions League goal of the season. He's yet to score in the season entirely, but look at this. Bang! There is no way the goalkeeper's ever getting to that. Paul has had a, has had a nightmare. And I think even he can't believe it. As the scene of the celebration is pointed to the sky. And his mother, I think she willed that one in for him. Beautiful goal, look at this again. Aaron Hillman is an absolute beauty. Let's look at this. It's clear by PSV. And uh, the cameras, but we'll do it from here. And look at this. Oh, that is so far out. There is no way Aaron should be scoring from there, but he did. Manchester United 5, PSV 0, and that is the pick of the bunch. An absolute rocket. How far out was that? You picked that one out, David Beckham. You picked that one out. Aaron Hill scored an absolute rocket there. It's not that far out, but uh, a lot of long shot takers will be in awe of that one. Beckham and Lampard and Gerrard, the long shot specialists. All of a sudden, Aaron Hill pops up with an absolute unbelievable shot. Oh, left the Manchester United crowd in awe. Actually, young shot to fleck it is a corner. At least I think it's a corner. And, oh, yes, it is a corner. Still can't get over there. And what a hit. He's actually on. Um, I'll take the corner. And when it's in the box, I think it even stunned him how far out he was. And Aaron Hilbert is not known for that at all. He's never done that in his whole career. But all of a sudden, I think he might start trying it a lot more. Here's Luke De Jong, tackled by Phil Jones, cool and composed. to make substitutes for Louis Van Gaal and you can blame him Young off the bar Bastion trying to slide the ball people and it's a corner 
Manchester United, an absolute route here. Unbelievable stuff. And he puts it back up and just whacks it. Oh. So I might check, might want to check the uh, inflation of the ball. This has been uh, hit with some belters tonight under the call up. And uh, cleared the Nazarene. There's no way back for PSV now. There's, there's just absolutely no way back. There's a way to get your first Champions League goal of the season. Aaron Hamill is totally taking the pick of the bunch tonight. Absolute rocket so far outside the box. That beats Ashley Young's, in my opinion. That's something we're used to seeing from Aaron Hamill in particular, but he might start trying it, as we said earlier. And he's again. He's still going to the fight. He still plays it through. Oh, and a Herrera. Wonderfully done, tried to play through Ashley Young. Well, what a way to get three points in the first Champions League game for a season or two. And, uh, wow. If it keeps going like this, Manchester United, have an easy ride of it. No easy games in the Champions League. Manchester United have made it look easy tonight against PSV, who have been absolutely nowhere. And, uh, wow. From the ball from Aaron Hill is the steal of the show. Martial, it's a bad mistake, really. I don't think he expected to get the ball. He was trying to go for the tackle. He's going to go out for a PSV corner. It's um, pretty much superfluous, if that's the word, though. Because uh, PSV have a long mountain to climb to get anything from this game. And now the clock's against them with 15 minutes left to play. Harry De Gea comes out. Oh. And uh, he's out of sitter. And the PSV player, he's got his head in his hands. I think he me realized he probably should have scored. And like I said, it, the situation is superfluous, really. And it's not the, it's a header, a clash of players. Lizarin brings it down. David De Gea is sidestepped and he shoots. And he still missed it. And it's uh, shades of uh, Firmino against Liverpool. Um, in Manchester United against Liverpool, where he missed the sitter, which probably could have won the game for Liverpool. And he scored it. Manchester United in just absolute cruise control. Even if PSV had, would have scored there, it would have been very, very little. Might be out. And right out. Justin Schweinsteiger. And uh, he finally makes a save. doing what he does best, no doubt about that. And he's no foul given. And three players protest. I'm sure he clears it. Ten minutes to go. And it's Manchester United. Uh, well, fantastic performance, I guess. The best moment. Crunching tackle. The referee looks to play advantage. And he booked the player. Here's the arm. Here's the arm. The fight. Great tackle from Aaron Hummel, but he's, uh, he's caught the player. And he's looking to clear it. Still allowing to go on, even though there's a player down on, in, on the ground there. Can we try to clear it away? And again with another shot. And he's trying his luck now. And he feels he can do anything. And, uh, another rocket here. And uh, his right foot. That's how powerful it is. The first, the, the goal was just, oh. Complete show of strength as uh, Wellens goes off for PSV for Hendricks to come on. And the ball is everywhere, and Bastian Schweinsteiger was looking to get his foot on that. And then to Bastian Schweinsteiger, good save by the keeper. And Zorik finally making some saves. And Bastian Schweinsteiger, who's been rather unlucky not to score recently. 
Good save. And the corner again. The fight. And the way. And now here's De Jong. De Jong is just met by everybody. Even Phil Jones. Two minutes of added time. If we could add on 15 and we'd still be looking at the same scoreline, it's been absolutely fantastic performance from the might of Manchester United. And I'll tell you something, they weren't the uh, they weren't the tip for winning in Europe this season. But um, based on this performance, anything's possible. Just decline. Beautifully done, but he lost the ball. Well, what more is there to say? The Manchester United 5, PSV now. And Aaron Henwood gets the pick of the bunch with an absolute rocket stunner from so far out. It's uncountable. Manchester United in a rout here. Manchester United 5, yes, 5, PSV nil. Unbelievable start. And uh, Manchester United would certainly like it if all their matches in Europe were as easy as this one. Man of the match, Anthony Martial, his first Champions League hat trick. Have a look at all the other scores from today's group stay matches. Real Madrid with a convincing 2 0 win over French champions Paris Saint Germain by two goals to nil. Apple FC lose to Sparta Prague by four goals to nil. Manchester United and PSV 5 0 was our featured game. Wolfsburg in the other group B match against Helsinki was uh, 1 0. So Manchester United take all the uh, plaudits at the top of Group B. Atletico Madrid lose to Benfica by three goals to nil. Shock there. Guy Tassaray beating Lazio by three goals to nil. Manchester City take the win against Juventus, the Italian champions, by a goal to nil. Sevilla FC 1, Borussia Munch and Blackback 3. And in, in the groups here, in the groups for you, Sparta Prior take the league in Group A with Madrid on equal points, of course, uh, with their wins. And Manchester United leading Group B convincingly after that win. Group C is led by Gad Tassaray and Benfica on equal points, of course. Munch and Blackback and City lead Group D. Barcelona lead Group C with uh, AS Monaco. I forgot to check the second scores, but I guess you can make that out for yourselves. Roma. Scoring with Monaco and getting a point there as well. Bayern Munich take the lead in Group F. Arsenal, who probably must have lost to Bayern Munich, actually, because Basel and Olympiacos get a point. So it's probably to be expected for Arsenal against the German champions, of course. Chelsea and Tel Aviv and everyone in Group G has actually scored a point. It was both draws. Lyon take the lead in Group H with Zenit, St. Petersburg and Valencia on a point. Gent yet to get off the mark.